Hello and welcome to the English faculty at Attleborough Academy. My name is Mr Hinton and I'm the Head of English and Media at this wonderful school. I joined in September and I absolutely loved it and I'm sure you will too when you come and join us. So I want to take a minute just to talk to you about some of the wonderful things that you'll be studying um, if you come to join us here at Attleborough Academy and in particular uh, come and join us in your English and Media lessons. So when you join us in Year 7, one of the first things that you're going to be looking at is a, a unit called Villains and Heroes, which is all about developing your writing and your reading skills. Uh, you'll also be looking at a media unit as well to help you start to think about the world around us and how the media affects our lives day to day. So that's your first term with us. But later on in Year 7, you'll start to look at Shakespeare. I know you've done some incredible things at primary school with Shakespeare, and we hope to expand on your expertise uh, with that here at the secondary school as well. We'll look at a poetry unit too, to get you thinking about those deeper poetry skills that you need to know for your GCSEs. And we'll also do a, a really interesting brand new unit on climate change. When you move into year eight, we study an amazing book called The Woman in Black. You may have seen the film, you may have heard of the play. I promise you the book is even better. We also study a play called Inspector Calls, and we look at another Shakespeare play called Much Ado About Nothing. Another thing that you'll do in year eight is some really interesting argumentative writing. It's really important that we develop those skills of arguing so that we can get our points across confidently. When we move into Year 9, we are starting to think a little bit more about those more in-depth GCSE skills. So we'll look more at poetry, and in particular we'll study war poetry, an amazing unit which happens at the start of the year. We'll do some fantastic creative writing schemes, and we'll also study a play called Blood Brothers. Then when we get to Year 10, we start to think about the GCSE course. So we make sure that we enter you for both language and literature GCSE you'll be studying a range of texts and a range of language skills as well. We tend to cover a Christmas carol, as well as studying the poetry anthology, which is called Power and Conflict. We also do a really important unit called the Spoken Language Study, which helps you develop your spoken language skills, your speaking and listening skills, so that you can express yourselves confidently when you enter the world of work or the professional environment. So we're really looking forward to working with you on those. We have so many opportunities to offer you as well. The department is full of amazing teachers and amazing staff who want to help you get the best that you possibly can. So we really look forward to meeting you. I want to take a minute just to show you some of the amazing work that we've also produced in English as well over the last, well, since we've come back actually, since September. And let's not forget as well that you can also study um, English at A level too. So if you'd like to join us at our sit form, we would love to welcome you onto the English literature course or the language and literature courses. You can also take media studies at A level as well, which is an incredible opportunity to learn and analyse videos and long form television drama, magazines, all different types of media. So again, a really fantastic opportunity to, to study, study A-level, either with media studies or with English. So essentially, we hope you stay with us for a very, very long time, from Year 7 right the way through to Year 13. We're really looking forward to hopefully welcoming you next year. And if you do have any questions or, or things that you want to learn about the school or about the English and media department, do please get in touch with me and I'd love to be able to help you. Um, so thank you very much and we look forward to welcoming you soon.